Hi there, my name is Andy Mohn and this is Tony Andreen, sales representatives of ACS Verizon Wireless. Today we would like to welcome you to Tech Talk, a special segment focused on discussing the latest in telephone technology and other ACS related products. ACS is proud to be a Verizon authorized wireless retailer and soon to be able to offer the largest 4G LTE network to our local communities. ACS has a array of options to suit everyone's needs. We really do have it all. Uh, from latest smartphones to local customer service. ACS and Verizon are connecting the community to what matters most. So let's get started. On today's segment, we're gonna talk about the smartphone cameras and some of the qualities and some of the things that you can uh, use your smartphone for. Um, when, if you think about it, um, most people don't usually have their digital camera with them at all times, where most of the time, you know, people usually have their phones or their smartphones with them. So with the, with the quality of, of the camera nowadays, it's an easy replacement uh, for the uh, digital cameras. Yeah, and with the, talking about the camera quality, you know, they've got, uh, you know, a lot of the smartphones have five to eight megapixel cameras, so really you're not going to notice a big difference between the quality of using your digital camera or your smartphone. Um, I know my wife's phone, we use actually that quite a bit for taking pictures other than uh, her digital camera too. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. yep. And not only cameras, they also have an HD video camera yeah. built in them so you can take some short videos and, and share them and things like that. Um, one of the neat things about uh, the smartphones and uh, the, the digital cameras on them is uh, just like your digital camera, they have uh, easily removable memory uh, so you can share the pictures or have them processed. Um, but there's also lots of different apps that are available that you can you know, share the videos or have them printed. Um, a couple of them just off the top of our head, I suppose uh, Walgreens has a neat one where you can load the app and go in and share a picture to Walgreens and just hop in the car and drive down there and have it just know, pick it up. printed and picked up. Yeah. No. No. Um, and there's a few of those other online services available too. So Yeah, a lot of the, the phones um, have uh, designated buttons for the camera as well, so it's easy to use. Mm -hmm. uh, like on, on Tony's phone there, um, there's a designated button. You, just, you can actually hold it like a regular camera and take the picture, so it feels a lot um, you know, just like your, your digital camera as well. Um, and there's some there's some fun special effects that you can you can do with them too. I've got a an iPad with a camera here too, and we'll show you how we can make uh, Tony look pretty cool. <laughs> so here's some of the special effects uh, that we can use with uh, this specific application. Um, you can see there's you know X-ray, um, you know thermal. You can you can make them look real cool <laughs> and use use one called squeeze. <laughs> Oh, so many different fun things that you can use, uh, and once you take the picture, um, there's many options as far as sharing it and viewing it as well that we can show you. I'm going to connect it to uh, a TV here so we can see how easy it is to, to view your pictures on a larger screen and share them with uh, you know, a group of people. They can sit on the couch and um, be looking at the pictures that you have. That should pop up here automatically once you click, uh, and then you can see the picture here. Um, you can switch between pictures. Um, you can also zoom in on a picture if you want to uh, you know, see something a little clearer, a little better. Um, you also can set it up as a slideshow through your options. Um, if you go to more and click slideshow, um, then it'll, it'll play through them automatically and you don't have to be hitting any buttons. Um, you also can edit pictures. Um, so if you want to rotate or crop a, a picture so it, it shows nicer, um, you can just click on, on one option, crop. And you can zoom in and you know, save it however you want it um, to be cropped. Um, another option is sharing the pictures. Uh, you can share them to Facebook. Um, if you have Twitter, you can share them on there. Uh, to do that, it's very easy. You just click on the picture and click on the icon. And it gives you all the options uh, that you can share it to. Uh, you've got your email, you've got an online album. Um, you can even print it from here if you have a printer that's supported, and you can text message it. Um, if we wanted to send it to Facebook, we just click on the Facebook option and it would upload straight to Facebook. Um, to text it to someone or email it to someone, it's very easy. Um, we just click on, on the email button, and you can type in the email address you want to send it to. 
And once you select the person, then you just can go down to the subject field and type in, you know, cool pictures, or whatever you want. And when you're done there, um, just hit the, the send button and it emails it right over to the person you want to send it to. Um, so very easy to use. Okay, so there Andy just showed us a few uh, different ways that we can share our pictures and edit our pictures and things like that. Uh, with the, the smartphones, there's many different options, uh, a lot of fun stuff you can do with the pictures to uh, make them creative, a little more fun. Uh, if you want to stop into any of our locations, we'll be glad to share some of that fun stuff with you. And, uh, and there's even more options uh, out there to uh, share the videos, so uh, we can get some hands-on with some of the demos that we have available to do that, so stop on in. Thank you for joining us today. If you had any questions on what we talked about today or any of our products or services, please feel free to stop by one of our Verizon locations. We'd love to help you out.